Hi, today I'm going to mess with Colada Exports and Second Life. I don't know if you're like me, but I have had a lot of problems exporting things uh, into with Colada file format into Second Life, and it's not picking up the textures. So I spent it's just a frustratingly large amount of time to mess with it. So we're going to try and solve this problem. So I installed a, a new non-free update. It's uh, about 600 textures. And let's, I don't know, let's pick something here. It's called Extreme PBR. It has 600 textures, all kinds of neat features, but that's not what this video is about. Oh, and they're all 2K also. Okay, so we added a texture to our lowly cube, and as you recall from previous entries, the, the cube is already unwrapped by default now in 2.8. All right. So if we want to export this thing, okay, this is a procedural texture with, with an image, and they, it generates a, I don't know, for me at least, it looks rather complicated set of nodes for the thing. But if we do an export on this thing, so we'll do an export colada and save it as an untitled, and now we go over to Second Life and do an import of this simple cube. And then say textures. We got nothing. It's not there. I haven't quite figured out why this is that it's not working. But I found a solution that hopefully will work for you. Okay, so we go back to our Blender file, and here's the solution to getting it to export the textures at the same time. So we edit texture, image texture, and I'm going to say new, and we're going to call this, well, leave it, we're going to leave it the same. We'll call it untitled, and then I go over and I do a bake on it. And at the moment, you can't do a bake in anything but cycles. And for this exercise, we're going to say it's a diffuse and do a bake. And okay, there's the progress of the bake. Now, we save this. As you can see, there's a little star there that indicates an unsaved uh, image. I do a save, untitled, as you can see, I don't have any there at the moment, save it. Okay, now we delete our material, create a new material, and that guy, type control T, move it over a little bit. And then pick Untitled, and there's our friend again. <clears throat> now I'm going to do another export, Colada. It's going to override that previous one. Okay, now let's do a build, upload, mesh model. Sorry, you can't see the file system here. I'm picking the Untitled. And then click textures, and voila, there it is. Okay, there's still some peculiarities about this thing that I don't understand. And hopefully I will find a little more information about it and get it to work a little more reliably at least. But this seems to work for the moment. So, okay, thanks for watching, and 
please subscribe and click like. And if you have any questions, put them in the comments below. I'll try my best to answer them. And oh, by the way, I think I mentioned in a previous video, but YouTube has changed some of their uh, mechanisms such that if you don't click the bell, you're not going to find out when I put new uh, videos up. So again, we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot. Bye.